everyone. Welcome to Pearl's Kitchen. Hi everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to make suji ka halwa. Uh, suji is semolina and this is my children's favorite dish. And all children love this and everyone in India knows how to make this but this is more for people in the West. And it's very quick and easy and the ingredients that we need for is you need one cup of semolina that's suji you need one and a quarter cup of sugar you need five green cardamoms and you need all these dry nuts. You could put less or more. I put extra because my son loves it and he's a bodybuilder, so this will do him good. So I've got three tablespoons of pistachio, three tablespoons of split almonds and cashew nuts and coconut, desiccated coconut. coconut. And I've got half a cup of uh, raisins. You could put dark ones or light ones. We need some ground cardamom and we need half a cup of ghee you could use butter if you want some of these nuts i've taken out and uh, put it for garnishing and i've chopped those ones up and you need a tablespoon separate for garnishing and here i've got half a cup of koa in india you get this at every indian shop but in england you can only get it in the indian shop in the frozen department this is optional i'm only using it because I had some left over but it comes very tasty with this so but you don't have to put it in here I've got three cups of milk this is also this is also made with water so it depends on how long you want to keep it if you make it with water you can keep it for a week but in my house nothing stays for more than one day so I make it with milk and and you can have this one within one or two days so now and here so if I put the gas on for the milk, and you need a you need a heavy based uh, pan, karai, and in there you put the first thing that goes is the suji. So you put the cup of suji because this takes a while now. Now you don't move from here; you keep stirring it. This this will take at least seven to eight minutes. Keep stirring it till it becomes like a, a dark golden brown color. So I'll see you after that. See now that while that's still, that's still take another five minutes there. You can leave that for a second. And in the three cups of milk that's here, and you don't need to boil that. You just need to add the sugar to it and the five cardamoms. All you need to do is split it. Just press it open. Don't open it fully. Stir this, just have to till the sugar melts. You don't need to boil it. Okay, and I'll see you in five minutes. As you see, it's starting to change color. You just, that's why you need a heavy a pan dish so it doesn't burn. is still off because otherwise it will start burning now from the half a cup of ghee you take one tablespoon of ghee and then you start put all these nuts in there and quickly start roasting all the nuts now the milk is also quite hot so you don't want the milk boiling so I put the milk off this one can come on Yeah. 
few minutes and you can add the raisins in here as well. Okay, keep browning it. I'm going to keep frying it. And you make this for your children, they will just love it. All the children love this. It's eaten for breakfast or for dessert. again. I 
had one tablespoon of ghee, so put that at the end. So I can give it a lovely coating. cool it down and set it on a big tray you can cut into like triangles and it looks nice but we just put it in a bowl and eat. so at this time the gas is already off and just take it out in the dish that you're going to serve it on top before serving your guests or your children and that's the suji halwa. so it's absolutely delicious try it and see what you think and don't forget to put your comments on my youtube channel and if you like it give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and share it with your friends I hope you all enjoyed cooking this. I'll see you next week with some more delicious food.